guys, hi guys, hey guys, what's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Today I'm gonna decompress after playing Lunar Dragon Song because, you know, I did not like that game very much. <laughs> but I do it all for you, and I do it all for free, guys. Well, I might die. <laughs> I might die. I do it all for you, guys. <laughs> We're gonna play Twiles of Mana. Hopefully we get hopefully we get trouble. I don't know, well it's gonna take a little bit of time loading. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. Bouncy rabbits, bouncy rabbits. Yeah, you can see those bouncy rabbits right behind me, right? Bouncy, 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 bouncy. <laughs> Dun 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 Hey, it sure is taking a while loading. Alright, here we are, here we are. Hey, look, it's Squeenix! Alright, guys, remember to spam memes to make this super transformative. I I don't know what scene is, but you know. Hey, what's up? No dragon song today? No, that, that was a one-time special event, and I will definitely probably never do that again. <laughs> no dragon song. <laughs> no. The world was shrouded by darkness within darkness. Hi, <laughs> mm. Anna Ben. How's the cutest number one bunny doing? Soon, soon, bunny. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's actually begin the game, yeah. Trials of oh, we didn't get shot with. Oh, that's so bad. All right, we're gonna play. We're gonna play an entirely new game. Let's see. Do we want to turn to break this up? Yes. All right, we're gonna play on beginner mode because I'm a casual scrub and uh, I can't handle anything, you know, really, really hard. <laughs> I don't know. Go, go ask him. I guess be Cora, maybe. No, 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 Hannibal. You're the cutest bunny. You, yes, you. You're cute. All right. Do I want to play as Duran or Angela? Uh, we are gonna pick Angela. Shall we? Oh no. Oh, what's this? <laughs> hey, Hawka. Yes. All right. We're gonna pick a. We're gonna pick a Reese. We're gonna pick Reese as the main character. And we're going to pick Shawit. And then for our third and final character, we're gonna pick Angela. <laughs> I am far from cute. My my like a big number prove that. Aw, don't worry about that. You are cute. I mean I don't have big numbers, which means I must be not cute, right? This is the party, yes. We want the old real party, yes. My favorite thing about Reese is, you know, how, how, how um, very silly that her, her, her plot is, you know, why she's going on this journey is. Of course, the first enemy she's gonna slay is, you know, make some KFC out of her, out of her harpy. You know, harpy meat makes the best KFC ever. <laughs> of course, um, Annabin, are you sure you want to play? Are you sure you want to watch me play this? I'm gonna be killing quite a bit of rabbits. <laughs> your numbers are bigger than mine, so you're no. I'm not cute. Not cute. No, not cute. Are you visiting Libra? Yes. All right, now get in there, Captain Reese. All right, Reese, spear that harpy in the spear that harpy so I can make some delicious KFC. I will not monsters to upset the peace of Laurent. Alright now. Alright now. Press that to evade. Power attack, go. Like that. Alright, you're wanting me to do a big power attack. There we go. Adversary purified. Can't escape. Alright, L1 in circle. Alright, there we go. Yeah, let's clear it up with wind. Yeah, harpies are very known to be weak to wind. I mean, aren't they traditionally weak to earth? 
Captain Race has defeated has defeated the has defeated the harpy. Now our kingdom can have some delicious KFC. The monster population As I feared, the monster population has increased. And yeah, it's almost like the bad guys are I up to something good. Oh no. It's almost like the bad guys are up to something evil in the world, you know. That's why monster populations in every video game are so, you know, so high. Hey there, Lord G Radiant. Amongus? Amongus. I mean, uh, it... If you type ex if you type exclamation point redeem sus, hey you you can you can spam Amongus. <laughs> I got bored of it after a while. Oh, that's a shame. This game is very good. Uh, it just has a uh, really wonky uh you know you know uh you know voice acting that's on the English side. Yeah, my favorite voice acting in this game is Shawit. Because she talks in the ooh woo Brooklyn Rage accent, yes. <laughs> Brooklyn Rage! <laughs> Brooklyn Rage! Ooh woo! Never managed to breach the Citadel defenses. I love you guys. You guys, yes, you, you're amazing. Hey! Hey, it's Joey Wheeler! <laughs> <laughs> All right, where do I have to go to get your older, your your older brother? Jim, let me tell you something, brother. <laughs> Hello there. Do you know where my brother's gone off to? Welcome back, Captain. I'm afraid none of the guards have seen Prince Elliot, Captain. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Say, what's in here? Hey there, Lightning Bimmer. Sorry for yesterday. Had to go get some fried moon rabbit. No hard feelings, right? No, we don't want to eat. Ra I mean, rabbits are super duper delicious and uh, super duper cute, but you know, we want to keep them around for emotional support. Yes. <laughs> Eat Doritos and drink Mountain Dew. I mean, uh, thank you, Mr. Edibin. Got Doritos and Mountain Dew. <laughs> I'm gonna eat some right now. Nom 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 nom. Bunnies eat other bunnies. I certainly hope they don't. <laughs> Have you seen Is it like hedgehogs where they eat their young? Interesting question. <laughs> I do not eat other parties. I assume he is still on the ground. Uh, uh, yeah, no. Boy, where could he be? Yeah, yeah. Anabin is too cute to eat other bunnies. Yes, that's because he's a good little bunny, and not a naughty little, and not a naughty little one. <laughs> Rolling around at the speed of sound. Yes, that's how you roll. That's how we roll, son. All right, now. Oh, a cup of wishes. That's basically like the Phoenix sound. Mm. Yep, they eat their own children. Hello there. Have you have you seen anything? Alma, have you seen my brother? Oh, have you seen my brother recently? Oh, how strange. Yes, you are cute. Animan is super duper duper cute. With you, your highness. <laughs> Hardly ever seems to leave your side after all. Wow, is the game volume really high? Are you? Apologize for that. It must be really too high. Sorry about that. Oh. <laughs> what did the bird say when a cage broke? Cheap, cheap. <laughs> I mean, my. What? Um. My favorite. My favorite. A lot of animals are cannibals, so no. Yes, uh. Even people can be cannibals, but that's usually frowned upon in modern society. <laughs> because uh, people don't like that idea. In fact, one of the villains of my Thor is a cannibal who, you know, eats people. Though to be fair, he to be fair, he used to be he used to be a chef that you know um, got cursed and you know was kind of sealed away for quite some time. And then he was released by but then he was released by evil Lord of Broccoli into the world. <laughs> Swore to show her brothers how she loved and affection as she could. Yes, there is an evil Lord of Broccoli. His name is Lord Broccoli. Yes, he's an evil dictator in the vegetable in the king in the vegetable kingdom. Yes, would you eat an Exodia? Nah, the best way to deal with Exodia is just throw it on the off the side of a ship. Yes. <laughs> or uh, you know, or you know, I uh, just. Or you know, just play, just play forceful sentry with du delinquent duel and uh, and uh, and uh, and, uh, and, and confiscation. 
Yeah, you can deal you can deal with the Exodia that way. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure all of those cards are banned. Hey, hey, you're the prince of the cathedral, right? Hey, look, it's a suspicious shadow. I sure hope this thing does not turn out to be evil. I mean, everybody knows this could this everybody knows dark shadows that are evil can be trusted. See, this guy looks like he's very trustworthy. <laughs> <laughs> everybody knows evil nin everybody knows ninjas are the most trust everybody knows evil looking ninjas are definitely the most trustworthy of people <laughs> yes wow these guys are definitely not up to anything bad definitely not I can show you more you know pebbles a great bark terrible bark Dark over the darkness, the great Barkomancer, and he is trying to convince everyone under the sun that he is. White fan, white fan! <laughs> oh, no! No! That's not that kind of, this isn't that kind of game, no. Did you have business here? Oh, you haven't seen my brother? There's a principle of nature that every creature knows. It's called survival of the fittest. And this is how it goes. I do like I do like Reese. I do like Reese for one reason because you can do that. I, I mean, um, no, I I mean I I didn't do nothing yet. White fan, white fan, no. Rolling <laughs> around at the speed of sound. Got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. Hey, look at treasure chest. Let's open that real quick. Candy. Yeah, candies are a healing item. Candies are an excellent healing item. Oh, for now, anyway. And I'm pretty sure I need to put those on the wheel, don't I? Alright, yeah. Whoops. Oh, they're already on it, okay. Well, yeah, they're already on it. Rolling, 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 ride. Hello there. Have you seen Elliot? I can't. I believe he was. I believe he was playing near the underground passage. <laughs> oh God, I was, I was also pleased with with yes, saving the world. So you got infinite dog treats for life. Oh, the currency in dungeons and doggos. Well, I mean, uh, thank you. <laughs> That was very nice of dog. That was very nice of that dog god to give me. <laughs> I'm sure I can find somebody. Who, I'm sure I can find a plenty. I'm sure I can find plenty of dogs that would really love that. Yes. Elliot. And you know, not starve to death. Come on, show me the. All right, now. These evil ninjas have left. Them, have convinced this kid to get into the sanctuary. First things first. <clears throat> I'm Bill. And I am called. <clears throat> Bill and Ben were both evil ninjas, yes. We're also super duper trustworthy, yes. Would evil ninjas ever lie to you? Definitely not. Never fear, never fear. We have a big <laughs> surprise in store for you. Come on, kid. I mean, your highness. Uh oh. Yes, show, show. yes lower the winds, yes. Lower your... Lower your nation's defenses, yes. I, I mean, ninjas can be... Like evil ninjas can be trusted, can't they? This room? I mean, would, would, would obviously evil ninjas ever stir you wrong? I mean, they came from the... It came from shadows that were purple, which means they're definitely good guys, yes. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. You know what? I like how pe like how some people some like how for some reason in Kingdom Hearts, King pe like like how people for some reason Kingdom Hearts trusted uh, uh, objectively evil looking dudes with yellow yellow eyes named Kingdom Hearts. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> yes, please trust us, evil ninjas. We just want to show you magic tricks. Yes, we're definitely not up to anything bad. <laughs> Okay, I believe you. But my sister Reese said I could never turn off the wind. Yes, please turn off the wind. Yes. Oh, you 
poor child. Yes, I mean, when people, when people, when people, when people use the entire thing is darkness and, you know, uh, be, and, you know, being an edgelord that, you know, gets their power from having no friends ever, you know, be tr untrustworthy. <laughs> yeah, this friendship is a strong power of light, and being alone is, uh, is also, is even more powerful. <laughs> It, it's only not because I cry myself to sleep at night and, you know, not have any, and because I don't have any friends. <laughs> you see, it's very lonely when you're a bad guy, yes. But Come on, kid. Oh, they're threatening him with bombs! No, don't throw fireworks at the kid! <laughs> <laughs> all right, I all right. I turned off the wind. Now you can get bring back my dead mother, right? Elliot, please get away from those suspicious ninjas. Step away from my brother. I like how she knows that they're sus. <laughs> we did it. We uh oh, they're preparing to invade. That's not good. So tough. Our oh no, they're storming the castle and they're gonna burn it to the ground. Burn! Burn it to the ground! Burn! Burn it to the ground! We speak! <laughs> the thieves of Navarro will take Citadel Lorat and make it the seat of our... Are we stealing a castle? Wait, what? We'll be stealing yes, my favorite person who ever stole a castle was Lord... was... was God... God Browser. <laughs> yes, he also stole the princess with the castle, yes. Filthy spies! Yes, we're evil filthy spies, yes. What was your first clue? Our attire definitely says we're evil ninjas, yes. <clears throat> Which obviously means we're into spy work and assassination, yes. No. Elliot. Ellie, we have to get the father, come with me! Uh, Elliot? Reese, you just left your brother behind! Yeah, I'm sorry, I left my brother behind, she got snatched, he got snatched. Wait, Wait Reese! <laughs> well, Man, that is so silly. Look at that. Your <laughs> sister left you here. What are you talking about? She yeah. clearly... Man, Reese is kind of, you know, uh, not very smart. <laughs> now, then again, uh, then again, say what you want about this kid. He, he's also not very smart either. Reese! Shut up. We need you to be the body of our Dark Lord, yes. Wait, that's also a thing that's later in the game. That hasn't been explained yet. <laughs> Oh no, whatever shall I do? Evil ninjas are attacking the base. Mm. I can't get no education. Hey, teacher, leave those kids alone. My education failed me so hard. I can only count the four. I can only count the four. And also, I totally trust evil nin evil looking ninjas, yes. I mean, would a, nin would a ninja ever lie to you? Yes, yes they would. Reese, are we just gonna leave your brother hanging? Oh no, I can't believe they- I can't believe everything's on fire! Oh no, they killed all the sexy Amazons! Yeah, sexy Amazons got redshirted. <laughs> the spores were spread through the cage row once the wind's- Uh oh. Oh no. They spread sleeping spores, they're gonna kidnap- they're gonna, um... Actually, I better not say anything. <laughs> There's a principle of nature. Oh, evil ninjas! Yeah, you're evil ninjas. Yeah, you're evil ninja assassins. You're not gonna beat me. You're not gonna win. We'll be here to forever, fighting in this judgment hall forever. <laughs> All right, level up. All right, rolling, 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 rolling. Uh oh, evil ninjas! Oh no, not the ninjas! Against the ninja! Oh man, they're obviously part of the Foot Clan with Shredder. <laughs> oh. mm. Yeah, that's my headcanon anyway. Get out of here. Ow, 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 I'm getting beat up by evil ninjas. Get out of here, evil ninjas. Yeah, how you like that? I I I got level I got level up. 
Yeah, I know how. I know how to. I know how to skill. Spend, I know how to spend skill points. You don't have to tell me. Oh no, the king is dead. And in retrospect, uh, if only you, if only you and your, if only you and your brother were smarter. <laughs> anyway, I could have probably avoided all this. Hmm. <laughs> It's probably not the kid's fault. I mean, he was probably he was you probably didn't you know go to school. The wind. The whole Nina's day was approaching. I mean, education in this world, education in this world is you know not very good. The shift <laughs> dulls my senses. Father, and now Elliot is gone. I've what are you talking about? You left Elliot behind, and he got snatched. <laughs> Yeah, you like ran up. You like ran up. You were like Elliot. We need to go see King Joster and you know save him. And, and he, he got and he's kind of like behind and you know you know got evil ninja snatched him. Please, please. All right. They kidnap Prince. They kidnap the prince. They want him obviously for some sort of evil mustache twirling reason. Muha ha 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 ha. I am an evil, dirty, mustache twirling villain. And also, I like to watch the world burn. It's not about the money, you see. It's about sending a message. Everything burns. The world burns! <laughs> mm. Oh, there's Belladonna. Oh, she said the meme, burn it to the ground! Now, now, excellent, excellent, excellent. Most of the enemy forces. We've destroyed the enemy forces. I'll return to Nerf out to report our success to whoever. Everyone, fall back now. Now, now. The wind. The wind, the wind is dead. I become so numb. The wind. And now the wind returns. If if. If only your, if only you, if only education were better in this universe. Elliot. What else should I do? Where should I go? Where should I go? Um, the school. My father. The school to get educated. Yes. yes. The priest of has Remember, stay in school. Don't trust the evil ninjas. <laughs> he will surely know what my next move should be. You didn't totally trap you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not taking the game very seriously, I might. Oh well, once we get into the action, I promise. Alright, I guess I alright, I promise I won't talk over the cutscenes anymore. I mean I guess I will. I like to think I'm funnier than I actually am. I leave father and our fallen countrymen to your care. Elliot is my responsibility. A green ribbon, what does it mean? This is my mother's ribbon when she was an Amazon. Wear my mother's ribbon with pride. May it protect me on my journey. Oh, I like that. She's wearing your mother's ribbon. That's actually pretty cute. I like that. Almost as cute as Mr. Hanneman. Against the ninja. <sighs> I've become so numb, so much more aware. And so, Reese set off to save her brother after, you know, going to school. Yeah, so she could learn how to recognize obviously evil bad guys. <laughs> fell to the agents of Navarro. The princess found herself without a home, a father, and her only brother missing. <laughs> she set out to find him. Yar, har, fiddly dee. Being a pirate is okay with me. Do what you want, because a pirate is free. 
Use it, emulator. <laughs> Remember, I do not endorse the cool crime of using an emulator. Yeah, please don't use the elephant emulator to emulate Nintendo games. Please don't do that. I mean, don't you know emulation is a crime? And, and if you do that, the gaming goddesses of game industry will come after you. Like low we will like a like Blanc, Lady Blanc will send her ninjas after you. <laughs> you don't want to you don't want to be in league with R4 the goddess of evil and destruction, do you? <laughs> <laughs> After all, emulation emulation leads to the deity of sin being able to take over game industry. <laughs> you know, I heard they remake the they remade the remake of you know Neptunia one. I mean, to be fair, uh, the first remake was on uh, PS PS Vita. Yeah. I mean, I have a PS Vita, but, you know, I can't play that game. Because the PS Vita doesn't, doesn't you don't want to play that. <clears throat> oh, well, at least I can play Tales of Heart R. And that's what really matters, really. Maybe one day I'll get a PS5, baby. Look at all these dudes. Hey, they're beating up the citizens. We can't allow them to do that. Yes, I'm an edge lord. <laughs> Barolian forces have taken the town and closed Six up in the harbor until who knows when. Stuck in the harbor. Right now, what's the plan? Looks like I don't want to. Looks like I don't want to bite that dude. Hopefully we don't. Hopefully we don't. Find a way to escape this town. The Beastman guards are attacking the town. I must leave this place as soon as possible. Alright, let's break open these jars because they have good stuff inside them. Ooh! Ooh, treasure chest! Alright, give me whatever the treasure is. We obtained chocolate! Yeah, Kara's favorite food. Aw, oh, the Beastmen are guarding the way out of town. That's no fun. Hey, you wanna fight me? I mean, uh, I can't right now. I'm like level two. I can't really do much in fighting, you know, beastmen because I'm level two and I'm so on class one. Beastmen of Ferolia look like humans during the day, but at night they transform into animals. Don't leave the house after dark. And they're so powerful that they basically need like class three to be able to beat them. Hey, if you're trying to leave the city, well, at least the elites of their clan, to yeah. Get together and. Yeah, that's a little later in the game. Nap, and, nap until nightfall. Very well, let's go to the inn. Alright, does anybody know where the inn is? I'm sure it's in a building that's, you know, marked in. Also, we're gonna splish splash in this water. Alright, um, too bad there's no wetness effects. Or, I mean, uh, not that we care about that now. <laughs> hmm. Of course, I don't. I don't care about witness effects. No, why? Why, why would I care about that? No. <laughs> it's probably in this building that's marked with a bed. Hello there, good sir. Will you let me stay? Will you let me stay at night? I'm gonna stay up at nightfall and then wait and wait for the full moon so that the bad so that the bad guys lose their sense of reason. Oh no, they turned into they turned into deviant art furries. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I heard some uh I heard there was some particular artist that worked on the models in these games. Well in this one anyway. Of course I don't know how true that really is. It's probably just a but it's probably of course, it wouldn't be. It wouldn't surprise me, really. I mean, we. I mean, in Fire Emblem Engage, you know, uh, you know that uh, somebody who worked on VTubers for Hollowife, you know, you know, made made many of the models in that in that game. Which means that, which is why they look like why they look like they're VTubers. <laughs> oh no, rabbits! Uh oh, Animen, look away. We're up against rabbits. 
<laughs> oh no, look away! There's rabbits! Oh, dogs! Oh no, doggos! Now you're doggos! Now you're you evil doggos! Oh no, they turn into bones when they die! That's no good! Oh, I feel bad for them now! Oh, poor doggo! <laughs> uh oh! Uh oh, rabbits! Get out of here! Yeah, I got poked in the face with my spear. How do you like that? Oh wow! Mm. I forgot how little experience you get without, you know, without all the AXP boosters. Battle begin! Uh oh! Uh oh, it's an enemy flying in the air. Get out of here. And give me my give me my 9 XP. Only in fire engages this VTuber lower as a video game. Oh uh, yeah, I mean it basically is. <laughs> I mean I I'd be up for VTuber lore as a video game. <laughs> I, I I wish I had I wish I had my own video game, yeah. <laughs> I want it to be I want it to be like a I want it to be like a Castlevania game. And, and, and it's like portrait room, you, know, you go inside of paintings. I mean, I, I mean, world canvases are part of the lore. And the world canvases are basically that. They, they were basically, they're basically, they're basically canvases created by the goddess of creation and they got defaced by, you know, an evil artist. It was an evil Lenny and Sid who, you know, defaced them with the pressure of madness in order, in order to, you know, in order to link them to, to be sacrificed to um, Lilith, the, Evil, the queen of evil, yes. Mm. Yeah, that's part. Of, that's part of the lore. So, um, if it were like Portrait of Rin, it'd be, it'd be kind of corrupted by you know part of by part of that el part of that evil Eldritch influence of Lilith, and and there'd be a bunch of bosses that were basically like like the souls of like the souls of heroes that were stuck that were they're basically like the souls of the world, you know, stuck in. Stuck behind bosses, and one of the bosses would be like a Alaric Yoon, which is like a big giant many plant monster lady. And she, yeah, I decided to make her into one of the main villains. Yeah, I like making Alaric Yoon like that. But uh, you know, uh, I was kind of drawn to Alaric Yoon back in you know when I was playing. Uh, let's see, what was it, Aria of Sorrow? Yeah, yeah, I saw it in Aria of Sorrow. I was like, whoa, what is that? What the heck is that? I, I need to I need to make something on that, and I agree that that was a. And I agree that game was really good. Too bad Reese has very little in the way of offense right now. He has very little in the ways of offense. Who item seed? I don't need the item seeds. I give you free items. So let's smash these. Ooh, magic rope. Yes, magic rope for all your uh, fantasies. Or I mean, uh, it's uh, for uh, magic stuff. Yes, we need to go this way. Yes. Oh no, it's some sort of invisible wall. That must mean that Mr. Mime was here. <laughs> what is a oh no, curse you, Delilah! Catch him. I can't believe Delilah Ketchum would have would have her Mr. Mind play pranks over here. <laughs> mm. I'm only kidding, of course. It's a horse, of course, of course, of course. Horse. A horse, a horse, my kingdom for a horse. Mm. Rolling around at the speed of sound, got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. Oh, so we gotta get over here. Hopefully this place... Alright, now. We're in another village. Alright, do we have enough Kern to, you know... You know, get, get some more stuff? You know, Kern is a currency in my world that's, like, basically just, a uh, Coin kernels made of precious metal, or it was in the past. Nowadays, it's a bunch of coins, you know. And, and they're marked with cor corn kernels. You got the bronze ones, you got the silver ones, you got the gold ones, you got the platinum ones. And yes, you have the diamond ones, and, 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 and there's also and there's also ones that are that are made of you know a special material that's very that's very very rare. 
Yes, fairy. Yes, it's made of fairy silver, yes. Which is different from regular silver. Uh, yeah. Basically, regular silver is just fairy silver that's, you know, lost its luster. And it's magic power, yes. Yes, that's what we're that's what we're deciding to go with. That's a nice pumpkin patch. Yeah, hop out of that fence. Two lucre! Oh boy, I gotta I gotta hold two cents! <clears throat> two cents and only one brain cell. Two cents and only one brain cell, yep. Yep, that's just how we roll, son. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. Hello there, mister. No one believes me, but I saw it. Strange light floating over the lake. Maybe it'll appear tonight too. Maybe it'll but basically I have to go basically I have to rest at night. Strange lights. I know what it, I know what it is. It's probably aliens. Yes. It's probably aliens or something, yeah. Yeah, it's probably the aliens from Majora's Mask. They're coming here to, you know, you know, punk, you know, punk these villagers or something. Yeah, aliens just run, like to run around and pull pranks on everybody for every for no reason. Like they like to leave crop circles everywhere and you know, uh, steal cows and you know, um, attack people for the lols. <laughs> yes, I tell you, aliens are some real comedians. <laughs> You know, just like ghosts. Just like ghosts. All they do is just minorly inconvenience people. <laughs> and you know, I, I'm thinking of one day, you know, reacting to ghost videos. <laughs> I'm gonna probably not take them very seriously, though. But you know, I'll, I'll, I'll try, I guess. Oh yeah, we got some item seeds. I guess we can grow those. We got like three, let's plant them. Candy. Mole bear claw, whatever that is. Miracle cookie. Yay! All our seed pots only like level one. Level thud. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. Hmm. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. It would be a stylish marriage. Yeah. I can't afford a carriage, but you look neat upon the seat of a bicycle built for two. Uh oh. It's the, it's the aliens. The aliens are active. Here they come. What the heck is that light? Somebody is like shining a flashlight over here. Wait, flashlights have not been invented yet. It must be a magic flashlight, yes. <laughs> yes. It's this new it's this new fangled thing called technology from the future, yes. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yes, there's also there's also time travel in this game too, yes. Yeah, we're gonna go to like a we're gonna go to like a final boss temple, and there's gonna be like circuit boards or something on the floor, and there's gonna be like modern technology, no way to and also there's gonna be ICBMs at one point. You know, sort of like Fire Emblem Three Houses. <laughs> also, we're gonna have to fight robots. <clears throat> yeah, and they're gonna be like transforming robots that are in disguise as you know ordinary vehicles. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! Digital Monsters, Robots in Disguise! <clears throat> Changing the digital champions to save the digital world. To save the esports world, yes. We're gonna save the esports world, yes. Sadly, some people would say that that is kind of beyond saving. I disagree. Hello there, Mr. Statue. Yes, that is a good way to save the game. All right, now let's put, let's stab a ram at a bunch. Uh oh, these guys are like level three. That's not good. Why are they so high level, man? Well, I should say in there like level three, but that's not really that high. Get out of here. Give me my XP, and I'm also level three now. 
Oh yeah, and I get a full heal from leveling up. Level up. Yeah, I got some candy. I love candy. My favorite thing is my favorite thing in the world. Candy, a serious business. First world, first world problems. Problems of the first world. Which basically means which basically means basically every complaint on Twitter. <laughs> alright, alright, now stab, stab, stab. Stab the rabbi. Ow, it bit me. The rabbi bit me! Get out of here. Get out of here. Stop being no, stop biting me. Macho macho man. I wanna be a macho man. Get out of here. Stab, stab, stab. Poke, poke, poke with the spear. Get out of here, man. Get adversaries purified. Oh, I'm trying my best to purify them. Uh oh, some more rabbites. They appear to be sleeping, so I can get the so I can get the drop on them. Uh oh. Ow. Ow, that thing bit me. Yeah, you're you're not gonna fight anyone anymore. Ow. Who knew rabbits were who knew rabbits were so vicious? They're such cute little creatures, and yet they're so mean. Say, what in the world is that? I'm sure that won't become relevant later. This is kind of sus, not gonna lie. Sus, sus, sus. Sussy, sussy, baka. I've become so numb, so much more nowhere. The best part about race is being able to roll and, you know, um, not, not that I'm looking at that, no. Say, what is this like? Oh, look, it's a fairy! <laughs> Alright, is this, is this a good fairy, though? Yes, it is. It's a little fairy. I like her blue dress. It's so cute. It's sort of like Mr. Anthony. So cute. I am Brice of Laurent, captain of the Amazon Guard. I saw the light from Astoria. I see. Oh. oh. I have no other option. So I suppose you'll do. Hold on. What? Oh, never mind. I'll tell you later. Please. I need you to take me to the Priest of Light and Wendell. I can't fly any further on my own. I am headed the same direction, but there is a barrier around the cavern. I think we are at an impasse. I can get us through the barrier. But we need to hurry. Something has happened to the Sanctuary of Mana. The Sanctuary of Mana? Wait. Uh, what's, what's going on? Oh my! Alright, for some reason the controller vibrated. Oh, we need to get going. Wanna rest inside me for a bit? Wait, what? Inside you for a bit. Yeah, fairy's just gonna hear me. Oh, wait. Hey, what? what? Uh-oh, we're being possessed by a fairy. Uh-oh. Alright, now. There's voices inside my head. And thus, Reese learned how to become a schizophrenic. I'm only kidding, of course. You take Fairy with you. Yay, we love Fairy. We stay in Fairy around here. She is definitely one of the. She's definitely one of the best video game fairies. And so cute too. Wish to see his eminence. Almost as cute as rabbits. I believe he can give me guidance. Not me though. I'm not cute. Easy time yourself. Yeah, I'm definitely not cute. I don't know why everybody thinks I'm so cute. Everybody's like, Endemati, you're so cute and everything. Why do you keep denying that you're cute? And I'm like, no, I'm not cute. No, 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 no. Not cute. Not soon. No. <laughs> oh. I'm not cute. And there's nothing to confess because I am not cute. <clears throat> I'm not gonna take a compliment because I'm not cute. No. 
I not Sundere? No. 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 Fake news, misinformation, lies. Don't believe the bunny propaganda. <laughs> Annabin's the one who's cute, not me. No. <laughs> All right, look away, Annabin. I'm killing one. I'm killing rabbits. <laughs> um. I'm not cute. I'm not cute. I'm not. Baka. 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 I'll, I'll enter your house and, you know, steal your left sock or something. Call me cute. <laughs> Bonnie is cute and adorable and soon. Yes, yes you are. <laughs> yes, I agree. The bunny is very cute and very adorable and very, very soon. In fact, I, in fact, I can't find any... In fact, I can't think of anything cuter than, than bunnies. I mean, some people think cats are cute, but nah. Bunnies now, they're, they're one of the cutest creatures ever. It's so, so adorable. So adorable. <laughs> uh, unlike bats, bats are not cute. Bats are feared creatures of darkness and the night. Yes. <laughs> Hear me, yes. I need I need more XP so I can level up. Are you killing rabbits? Oh yes, yes I am. Yes, they're one of the enemies in this game. They're trying to bite me. They're they're mean. They're trying. They're biting me. They're mean little creatures. Unlike unlike cute unlike cute adorable bunnies, which you know are ne are never mean or ne are never mean. Right now, I need I need more XP. Where can I find more XP? All right, looks like there's some level three guys over here. Yeah, here you assassins. <laughs> Only because you were in their territory. <laughs> I will bite you. Ow! Annabin is so cute and soon. I'm sorry, I'm mur I'm murdering all the rabbits. But you see, I need that XP, I really do. It's to raise my level of violence. It's to do what all RPG heroes do, and raise their, which is to raise their level of violence. Yeah, we're gathering execution points to um, increase our love. And everybody knows that, everybody knows LV stands for love. <laughs> uh, what does LV stand for? My love, of course! <laughs> <laughs> kill some bats then. I mean, okay, I'll kill some bats eventually. I'll kill some bats eventually. I mean, I believe there's some in the I believe there's some in the dungeon that we can kill. We're bats. We're bats. We're the bats. We pray at night. We stop at night. We're the bats. I'm the giant bat that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of travel we can get into. Alright, now we need to train. Alright, we need we need a trainer. We need to get our, we need to work these muscles of mine. We need to work these muscles of mine. Now let's get some extra strength. Victory CS boost is bad. And let's increase spirit too, yes. Not that right. Anybody else will increase spirit right now. So we have to equip the abilities. Might as well go with Victory CS boost. It's as good as it's we don't really have too many good skills to get to right now. 
I sure hope the village is okay. You took friends from me because you couldn't control yourself. Mm. Alright, everything's... Wait, what? What? The village got war crimes? How did it get war crimes? We were... We... We were just here not too long ago. What happened? What happened? Where is everyone? I think they got war crimes. <laughs> it looks like the work of beastmen. Darn, we have to defeat them. Uh, which we would do if we were playing as Kevin or, you know, um, uh, Charlotte. Yeah, Kevin would be the guy who, you know, would be the one that would be... Uh, unfortunately, we're not playing as him. We're inside playing as we're, we're inside playing as waifus, yes. Well, uh, two waifus and also as uh, Charlotte. <laughs> we we see an Angela around here. Angela is is uh, really really beautiful and also also really 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 really, really awesome. All right, now let's go poke some mushrooms in the face. Out of here. I want no shrooms. Winners don't do shrooms, guys. <laughs> Winners do not do shrooms. If anybody, if anybody, anyone, these are shrooms. Shrooms. These are shrooms. Psychedelic shrooms. They aren't glamorous, they're not cool. And, 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 and if you do them, they can kill you. Listen, everyone wants to be cool, but, you know... <laughs> oh, no, shroom. Hey, did it not pop up? Oh, no. Oh, well, I'm sure that'll be fun. Oh, well, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, don't do... don't... winners don't do shrooms. Oh, the barrier's throwing me back. Give me a moment. I'll get rid of All right, fairy, clear the barrier for me. Yeah, the barrier's gone. There. You should be fine now. Let's head inside. Let's head inside. I'm sure we'll be perfectly fine. I need mean, kind of abilities would be good right now. Obviously, anything that restores HP, you know, after battle would be really good. Cascade Cavern and it's full of gabos. And also more magic mushrooms. Oh, and there's bats. All right, anybody wanted us to kill some bats? I mean, if we kill a lot of bats, it'll even out, you know, killing all the rabbits, right? <laughs> We're bats. We're bats. We're the bats. We pray at night. We suck at night. We're the bats. Get out of here, bad guys. I'm the giant bat that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves in, into. Oh no, bats! Bat on bat violence. You hate. You hate to see it. <laughs> We're bats. We're bats. We're the bats. Oh yes, give me more money. I need that filthy lucre. I need another cent. Another coin. To fill my bottom line So I can make Another mediocre game Like Lunar Dragon Song Now thank you for the ear scratches But you see there's a principle of nature That every creature knows Oh I don't think we can do anything here I'm glad you're feeling better than yesterday though Oh, yes, 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 yes. I'm just glad I don't... I'm just glad I'm not playing Lunar Dragons. <laughs> I'm glad I'm playing something I enjoy. <laughs> I'm glad I don't have to walk around very slowly because... Hey, I, I don't want to take damage from, you know, just running around. I mean... I mean, what is that trying to say anyway? That exercise kills? Exercise... Oh, no, I'm sleepy. Oh, no, I got put to sleep. Time to go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Item seed obtained. 
Oh no, bats! There's a lot of bats in here. Uh oh. Oh, watch out for the supersonic waves. Yeah, here you bats. Yeah, we, mur we murdered a bunch of bats. I mean, like that. I murdered. I murdered some bats. Uh, um, game should have a dragon song mode where you get where you're running six HP. Ah, uh, to get the true lunar dragon song experience, we're gonna have to have a lot more fun and exciting features than just that. Like, why why stop there? Why not make it e why not make it even more? Why not make it even worse? Like, uh, you can only get items that. Like you have to choose if you want experience or items, and you can only get and you can only get um, and you can only get money from doing jobs. And to do jobs, you're gonna have to grind out items. <laughs> and if you're not grinding out item, and if you're not getting items, you're you're and if you're getting items, you're not getting experience. And if you're getting experience, you're not getting items. <clears throat> Which and um, some of the items are very rare drops. <laughs> I mean, what what could go wrong with that? Hey, I got a couple of wishes. I, I wish, I wish upon this cup that you know. I wish, I wish upon this cup that you know I did, I that Lunar Dragon Song was an actual good game, and you know it wasn't the final death nail in the Lunar in the Lunar series. <laughs> unfortunately, 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 we're gonna have to snap back to reality. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Reality can be whatever I make it. Cause I have Thanos cause I have cause I have the magic Nintendo power glove of Thanos. <laughs> and show it! Ooh woo! <laughs> oh no! It's everybody's favorite character in this game. Including my especially mine. Just listen to that awesome voice acting. I'm Charlotte. I'm a famous beauty for <laughs> Wendell. This is no place for one so young to play. But, 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 uh, <laughs> oh, she's crying. Charlotte will, Wendell. All right, I get. All right. Any items obtained during the flashback will be lost. All right, now we're gonna do a flashback chapter. Just let me stretch for a minute. Just let me stretch for a minute. I apologize. Mighty daddy, da, just wandering about. Charlotte, the greatest character ever and has the best voice acting. Hey, it's Mom and Pop! Hmm. You know that elves and humans getting married is super cursed in this game? You know, yeah. <laughs> of course, we all want the elf waifus, but we don't want to deal with the consequences of having an elf waifu, like the fact that she'll probably outlive you. <laughs> <laughs> and, and that and that elves being related to fairies do all sorts of weird things and have all sorts of stipulations and rules. <laughs> don't leave me. No, don't leave me. I'm your only daughter. Mama. Papa mama. <laughs> My favorite voice acting though was um King DDD and you know they um the English dub of, you know, Kirby right back at you. I mean, he sounded exactly like Froghorn. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I say. <laughs> I don't think I can do a good voice for him, though. I'm not, I'm not a good voice actor, no. I only know how to, I only know how to do terrible memes and, you know, play video games very poorly. <laughs> That's the only thing I know how to do. <laughs> <laughs> it will, shall we? <laughs> it will, Bookwin Wage. <clears throat> you 
can't beat my, you can't beat my Brooklyn Rage. Sean, are you okay? Mm. So the cuteness is natural then. No! So no, 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 no. <laughs> Looks like you're mm. okay there. No, that's no. You're being brainwashed by the fairy glamour. Don't don't fall for that. Bye. <laughs> mm. Don't fall for the fairy glamour. It's brainwashing you. <laughs> yeah, please don't. I'm not. I'm not cute. Being me, me being cute is literally super villain propaganda. Yes, it's literally spread by SIN, which is a fake news website, which is a fake news organization run by you know. A super villain, yes. And, and they spread fake news like me being cute. Or Sundre. Which is not true. <laughs> I feel pretty young. Uh, no, no, no. I don't I don't think that, Anna Ben. <laughs> Besides, I'm the one that has I'm the one that has only one brain cell, guys. <laughs> the mana statue has begun to cry. <laughs> my brain is smooth and my head is dented and you know I only have one brain cell. It was bright as day. I do not. But I believe it has to do with a change in the mana power of the world. The yes, look into look into the mysterious light. The but, you know, it turned out to be fairy. Would of course, we know it's fairy, but she doesn't know yet. Yes, you're in court. I'm not cute! I believe there is trouble There's trouble in Chad as well. We should erect a barrier in Cascade Cavern to protect Window from any interlopers with bad intent. It'd be the safest plan. Uh oh. A white, huh? It could be dangerous. Then you need to go after him? Oh. You wanna go after you wanna go after Heath because he's your husband though? I like that I like that I like that. That's dedication. I'm pretty sure it might be a one-sided relationship though, really. Are there any treasure chests and any treasures in Maybe, but I'm not gonna worry about that. Besides, I'm gonna lose all the items I get in, in here anyway. Might as well take the candy. Jump, jump, like a kangaroo. Jump, up, like a bunny. Like a cute bun bun. Bun bun. <laughs> of course, we gotta start saying bun bun more. Come now, Charlotte. You're not oh, wait. supposed to. Let me go! He's gotta say keep. Let's go a different way. Jump, jump, like a bunny. Oh, they won't let me go. I won't let you go. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna run around and desert you. Never gonna make you cry. Never gonna say goodbye. Oh, hi, Charlotte. Mick, I know you aren't some dumb little kid anymore. Come on, help me get to Estonia. What? You want to go to Astoria? But there are monsters in Cascade Cavern. Plus, you don't have no magic like the grown ups. That's because she hasn't been exposed to, you know, elemental energies from the elemental spirits. But she doesn't know how to use a basic cure spell. I may be a. I mean, imagine not knowing a basic heal spell and being a healer. <laughs> imagine being a healer and having your heal spell cost like 10 MP. And you only have like, uh, you only have like 20. 28 or so. Got it. I mean, that means when he casts it once on both party members, you know, it's completely useless because you can't cast it anymore. <laughs> I don't know why they gave why they gave the heal spell such a high MP cost in that game. Surely healing should be surely, surely a basic heal spell should be you know not too expensive, really. I mean, most video games have the decency to make the basic heal spell really cheap. Or, you know, give you MP to actually use it over and over and over again. Unlike Lunar Dragon Song. 
All right, now let's sneak out. Oh, good. It's nighttime. All right, we're gonna sneak past the. We're gonna sneak out. We're gonna sneak out of the cathedral and past the defenses. Yeah, just don't worry. You didn't see. You didn't see nothing, dude. You didn't see nothing. There's a principle of nature. Yeah, so we have we have a flail. Ooh, what's that? A treasure chest. All right, give me what's inside. Hey, we got a chocolate. Hey, Charlotte. Now stand back. It was hard for me to. All right, now how are we gonna get out? How is Charlotte gonna get out of this place and reunite with her white food? This is a spring. Yes, those are for losers. Real chaos. Real chance kill enemies before they get hit. A dragon. A dragon's on death, maybe. I mean, uh, but most of the starter, and, but the enemies level up with you and are often faster than your, than your starting speed. And the enemies level up with you. So you're not, you're, so you're not able to be, so you're not able. <laughs> yeah, that's why grinding doesn't even help you in that game. Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> and if you get blinded or paralyzed, you can forget about it. Especially if it's the main character who can do the three-hit attack. One of my favorite features of Dra Lunar Dragon Song is when, you know, the main character gets cursed. And, you know, can't do their three-hit combo. Which means they have one hit. Yeah, for some reason, yeah. <laughs> That's quite a wonderful and fun feature. It reminds me of a. Uh, it reminds me of that one. It reminds me of Beyond the Oasis. It reminds me of Beyond the Oasis. You know, it's Samson when he got cursed, and he never actually, you know, improved after getting the curse fixed. He he stayed he stayed, he started off being bad and he stayed bad. Now what? <laughs> <laughs> well, we should talk about things that we like about video games. Like in this one, I like Angela because Angela is the best character. And also I love mages that can, you know, DPS the enemy. I mean, usually mages aren't quite known for that, but you know, you know, having a good mage is really good. I mean, I'm kind of a mage, you know, um, I'm kind of a mage, you know, cleric, you know, thing build. Yeah, I can use a few basic strike attacks with my staff, yes. It's easy to bash enemies upside the head with them, you know, if you charge them with magic energy. Things we like in video games. Poison Swamps! Yes. My favorite Poison Swamp is inside of a booby trap filled clock tower, and there's Medusa heads, and Rippers, and, you know, all sorts of fun enemies. Also, there's disappearing Mega Man blocks in one area while you're dealing with Medusa heads. And, and if the Medusa heads hit you while you're in midair, you'll turn to stone and you'll fall into the poison swamp and take and take double damage from the poison. And also, if you land in the poison swamp, you sink down, 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 and, and, and then there's spikes at the bottom. And when you're in the poison, your controls are inverted. You don't like you don't like in that one level in Donkey Kong Country Three. <laughs> And, and if you stay under there for too long, you're going. You're not only gonna, you're gonna take not only a ton of damage, but you're also gonna, but you're also gonna, you know, <laughs> you're also gonna, you're also gonna die rather quickly too. <laughs> yeah, and, and the only way, and the only way to get rid of the poison is, you know, to beat the boss at the end of the dungeon. And, and by then, you don't actually have to go back to the dungeon because why would you go back to such a miserable place? In fact, there can be all sorts of fun traps. There can be like pendulums that you have to jump on, and if you're not very, and if you're not good with your jumps, you can end up in spikes. <laughs> and again, and 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 you know, <laughs> and in fact, why you stop at spikes? There can there can also why you stop at spikes? There can also be traps in there that damage. There can also be traps that in the spikes that you don't damage you even more than the spikes already do. <laughs> uh oh, Rabbi. <laughs> and, and, and there can also be Medusa heads while you're trying to swing on the pendulums. And sometimes there will also be imps as well. And the imps will like and the imps when they get on you, they will like make you run into the spikes. 
How you like that? I beat that rabbit up with a file. Leave it to me. All right, all right, all right. Rolling around at the speed of sound. In fact, you know what? You know what enemy would be? You know what enemy would be perfect for a clock tower and poison swamp? Those urchins from Tales of Fantasia, which can only be killed by very specific means, and you know, will one shot you if you're not careful. <clears throat> because why? Why would you have? Why would you want an encounter to be balanced? In fact, you know what would be even better if you know we if why do you know what would even be better than in you know you know. You know, spikes, poisons, swamps, and clock towers? If everything works under the controls of, you know, up when they what? Hi there, what's up? How are you doing? Yeah, they, they should make the, they should just make the game work like Lunar Dragon Song. <laughs> yeah, so you have to choose if you want XP or if you want, um, or if you want items from the bad guys. And the only way to get gold is to do arbitrary fetch quests. Mm. Except you don't, yeah. And and, gear, and if you want new gear, you're going to have to you're going to have to clear every enemy, and you're going to have to run around very, and you're going to have to walk around very slowly because you know moving too fast will hurt you because you'll be losing HP. How is this game? Oh, it's very good. This game is very good. I love it a lot. All right now. Heading in the direction of Jad, okay. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Alright now. I sure I sure hope nothing bad happens to Heath, by the way. That'd be very terrible, wouldn't it? Almost as terrible as a terrier. Of terrible, terrible darkness. Within darkness. Yes, yeah, so and we have to say darkness within darkness, yes, we need to make fun of Kingdom Hearts. We need a duck on the very silly story that is Kingdom Hearts. You know, I should probably play I should probably play Kingdom Hearts again. Or you know, play any Kingdom Hearts games really. You know, I've only really played the first one. Yet and I have a huge collection of, you know, Kingdom Hearts games and I've only played the first one. Yeah, but you have to play all yeah, don't have you don't just play one, two, and three though. You have to play you have to play all the supplementary ones and get introduced to the characters. And and the lore becomes really confusing with things like time travel and dreams, and and, and um and and there's all also at one point you know Sora you know um gets an X on his clothing which allows the bad guys to track him. <laughs> and, and and a lot of the heroes are like they can they'll just trust any bad guy that comes across, even though they're very obviously evil. Uh oh. Leave Keith, leave Heath alone! Stop bullying my boyfriend! Oh well. Give her a break, she can't quite beat him because she's only level 3. And she doesn't know how to cast, and she doesn't know how to cast Holy Boat. Don't worry, Charlotte. I took care of him. What are you doing here? Oh, oh, yeah, Holy Boats. That's what, that's what every JRPG... That's what every JRPG boss should turn into. Is oh no, what the heck is this? No. No. Uh oh. Make it stop. Uh oh. What the heck is going on? Oh no, what? Not the darkness! No, not the darkness within darkness! No! Oh no! Oh no, it's a clown! Well, we all know that clowns are good news in any video game. I mean, just look at Mad Jack or Kefka or or Joker from a uh, from Clona or Demento or Marx. All very nice clowns that just want to have fun and entertain people. You know, by you know by turning everything into by killing everything in sight. Run if you know what's good for you. I mean, it it. I mean, if you had a friend like Marx, um, you would feel so very safe, right? <laughs> in fact, I'd be very surprised if, you know, every character in, you know, Kirby didn't, every, every character in Kirby didn't turn out to be a traitor. Although, can I tell you something very interesting about Kirby lore? Uh, you see, you know the butterfly? 
The butterfly was the butterfly was always there. Yeah, the butterfly was real always there. It was in the opening of the first Kirby game. You know, for the Game Boy. Yeah, the butterfly was always there all along. As the beast men began to attack it's true. The of Jad. Alone. Which means that Morpho Knight was always watching. Always watching. <laughs> and of course, Jeffle, yeah. <laughs> I'm very serious about that butterfly. <laughs> Of course, Kirby fans are probably the only people who are probably scared of butterflies, I mean. Why would anybody be scared of butterflies? They're not that scary. Then again, they, then again but butterflies in real life do drink blood. <laughs> yes, I, I've seen pictures of it. I've seen videos on YouTube about it. <laughs> and Morpho Knight basically eats people's souls. Including the souls of the strongest warriors in the entire galaxy. <laughs> even, even the final, even the final boss, and even the final. I mean, in Japanese mythology, butterflies are linked to death. Oh no. Wow, that must mean that that must mean that traditional fairies are very scary for you know to Japanese. It's got butterfly wings. Well, young lady, I am on my way to see the priest of light. Don't worry, Shawa, you can come along with us. Yes, I want to see your grandpa. Let's go. My grandpa's deck has no pathetic cards, Kaiba, but it does contain the unstoppable Exodia. <laughs> <laughs> what Exodia? Uh, what Exodia? That's not possible. Nobody's ever been able to summon him. <laughs> All right, we got Shawit with us. It will. Shawit, you took friends from me because you couldn't control yourself. Let's call our recovery. Ooh, healing light. Yeah, I do want the I do want the healing light. All right. Now we're gonna have to invest in we're gonna invest in that so we can get heal light. <clears throat> Grandpa had only gra Grandpa only had granddaughter with speech <laughs> with speech tick. <clears throat> I mean, wait, what do you mean? Uh, you know, what do you mean? We what do you mean? Uh, Charlotte's voice acting is absolutely one hundred percent perfect. In every way. Come on, hit that bad guy, yes, with the power attack. Oh, watch out for the axe throw. Watch out for him throwing axes at ya. Alright, bad guy. Adversary, purify. What do you mean? The voice acting for Charlotte when in English is very, very good. Absolutely 100% perfect. Yeah. I mean, it reminds me of four kids' voice acting. Which me, which is, which, you know, but you know, how can that not be five stars? Oh no, I got hit with the axe. Got your gabo. Mm. Alright, we got a couple wishes. That might be useful because I'm actually not very good at this game. Hence why I'm playing on hence why I'm playing on baby boy easy mode. Eh, easy mode oh! <laughs> Only grade schoolers should be playing on easy mode. <laughs> It's only appropriate that preschoolers play on easy mode. <laughs> yeah, remember if you play on easy mode, the moon bunnies will troll you. Or <laughs> 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 move, Yu Gi Oh! It's time to do 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 go to prison! Yu-Gi-Oh! Digital Monsters, Robots in Disguise. See? Here, Bob and yo champions to save the eSports world.
Yes, go to Yu-Gi-Oh! Prison. Bow down, bow down, before the power of Santa. <clears throat> Alright now, damn ourselves a tree user. Yeah, a couple of wishes. It's like a couple of ace, but you know, not as good. <laughs> bow down, the holy city of Wendell. Yes, it's also home to the, it's also home to the Roman Catholic Church. Yes, nobody expects the nobody expects the nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> Holy City of Window. Yes, we already know we already know where we are. Game, you don't have to tell me by you know placing a sign in my path. Yeah, I mean that sign just popped up in my path and um. Was telling me where I already am, even though the title already told me where I was? Uh, I don't know what happened, dude. <laughs> Game must be bugged or something. <laughs> I'm only kidding about that. I don't actually mean that. I have to reiterate that those things are a joke. Oh, Alright, buy the pajamas. Buy that. All right now, can I, can I buy some cool? Can I buy some cool weapons? I wanna buy. I wanna. I wanna buy. You know. I wanna buy like a new spear. I wanna buy a new spear so I can have the spear of justice. After all, the spear of justice is very good. Off the chair, please. Wait, you're not open. You're not even open. Hmm. Bounce, bounce, jump, jump, like a kangaroo, jump, jump, like a kangaroo, hop, hop, like a bunny, like a cute bunny. Yes, after all, bunnies are one of the most cute things ever. And I will not stop saying it, no matter what. Because bunnies are super duper duper adorable. There's a principle of nature that every creature knows. It's called survival of the fittest, and this is how it goes. Welcome to in welcome to the welcome to the Endymati Super Show, where we where we say all the seal crusty memes and you know play video games very poorly. And uh, and also and also and also we reminisce about living in a magical and also we reminisce about living in a magical girl anime. Yes. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. If you want to hear the word, you're more than welcome. To, you're more than free to ask. You know, I should probably make like a dedicated lore video, but it would probably be like a quite long, maybe. Trying to explain most of the major things in it. I mean, there's things like interdimensional travel, there's also dreamland, there's also the mirror dimension. Oh yeah, and there and there's time travel. Yes, time travel is in the lore, yes. The thing I use to time travel is called the Banos, it's a hand-shaped time machine. I was inspired to make it because of time warp tickers for, you know, in, you know, Action 52. The princess of Laron <laughs> was unable to save my father and... No! Manos, the hand of time. I fear the so its name is Hands, the Hands of Time. And there's like two of the Manos, but you know, one of them got stolen. The Mana Tree is withering! I know what, I know what the cause of this is. It's called Modern Technology. I learned about it in a Tales of game. Yeah, everybody knows technology bad. <laughs> Stones will break. I mean, I mean, Blasty on X Spears being evil? I mean, whenever I see, you know, technology inside of a Tales of game, I always assume it's going to turn out to be evil, because that's basically what every Tales of game does. You've been chosen by fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the sword of mana. In fact, if technology doesn't turn out to be evil in, you know, any in any Tales of game, you know, and, it, and it's not there. I always think, uh, what? What is this? This is not a Tales of game. I'm sorry. Yeah, I kind of appreciate that Tales of Azaria kind of deviated from, you know, the usual tropes. 
sanctuary for long uh, aside from you know having an angelic uh, angelic villain at the end that is something that you know tales of games always do <laughs> i am sorry but finding elliot takes precedence uh, please it's not a tales of game unless you pick a fight with the forces with you know with you know diet lucifer or whatever <laughs> Once a fairy finds... Oh, but, but I... And I should definitely play more Tales of Games. No time to Let's see, Italy, Vesperia, Berseria, Methonia. I played a little Zesteria, but eh, I really don't like that game. You can bring that is not a good Tales of game. Sorry. Oh my. I tried to like Zesteria, but you know, yeah. It was like, eh, blah. I don't like it. I mean, I also play Tales of Arise, too, yeah. And Arise kind of, you know, did a lot of the usual tropes. Even having characters be like, we should, you know, all those villains we've been killing all throughout the journey, we should probably be merciful to them, because they're people, too, even though, you know, we're going up against, you know, a villain that's basically a mustache-twirling super villain that, you know, killed a bunch of people and seems to enjoy being evil. Fairy is almost as cute as a certain- no. No, 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 no. I am not cute. Fairy is cute, but I am not cute. What you see before you is called fairy glamour. <laughs> I'm actually hiding- I'm actually hiding very deep scars on my body. You know, from all the super villains I've been fighting. I mean, one of them even ripped out my wing one time and, you know, ate it. I, I was able to regenerate it with white magic, though. Thankfully, because white magic is super strong in my universe. Of mana energy. Mana but yeah, that's a thing that happened to me in the lore. The I have the scars to prove it. If you activate the mana stones... The portal <clears throat> connecting our world to the Sanctuary of Mana should appear. Through that portal... So Andy is it? No! Not an infinite food supply! Why would you say that? The energy Ain't it been? The eight mana stones Ain't it been? Does this look delicious to you? The mana goddess began her Does this look like food to you? <laughs> I know the meme is, you know, there's a certain fairy that's emergency food, but, you know, that's not me, no. In fact, rabbit, you know what, you know what would be good right now? The rabbit stew. However, refuse to allow each other control of the and you... Well, if I eat a part of you, you can regenerate it, right? Annabin, please don't do that. I have a lot of trauma from fighting the butcher. <laughs> because because a magical girl's life is a lot like Peter Parker's. It's full of suffering. Rabbits are not food. Yes, they are. Lots of lots of humans eat rabbits. Because rabbits are super delicious and super super tasty. Yeah, so I'm gonna nibble. I'm gonna nibble your ears, Annabin. I've heard with what remains of her power, she can. And I'm serious. See if you may. Also, I learned if you if I blink, you know, I can I can. The hero of time eats fairy. You know, a hero of time that eats fairies. I am pretty sure that I'm. I'm pretty sure that's not true. You know that you know, that's not that's not actually true. You know, like fairies just are contained in bottles, and you know, just do a heal spell. Link doesn't eat them. <laughs> they just you know go away after you know after you know he do, after you know he does a thing. <laughs> All right, let's get Charlotte and go. Oh, uh, Charlotte didn't want to join. Didn't want to show up to her grandpa. Whether you like it or. Let's go. 
Deep in, deep in the underground. Deep in the underground. We're in too deep. We're in too deep to quit now. It's a sunk cost fallacy, guys. Hmm. I'm not convinced. I mean, you can add various to food in Breath of the Wild. Yeah, they, yeah, they cast an enchantment on it. Yeah, maybe maybe Link really does eat fairies then. <laughs> oh no! Wait, wait, yeah. Please don't, please don't eat me. <laughs> then again, I begged the internet not to, not for, for me not to play Lunar Dragon Song, and they were like, uh, "Play the game, Indomati. You're going, you're going to love it." <laughs> But then again, it's mostly my fault. I'm the one who decided, you know, I would do Lunar Dragon Song as you know what as you know what goal. And then uh and then when it happened, I was like, uh, dang, this game really, 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 really sucks. <laughs> oh boy, dance! I'm the giant I'm the princess of bats that makes all the rolls. Mm. I guess I I guess I'll have to have a taste first. No, 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 no! You're not, you're not tasting me. No, eat, no, eat the bat. No eating me. No, I'm not emergency food. <laughs> yeah, I should make that a redeem. What? I missed. Hey, don't, don't do that. Okay, get that armor off you. Get out of here. I win. Certainly. Right, that's the way to go. I mean, I kind of want to get some more XP first. Luckily, there's some more bad guys over here. Yeah, you're bad. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Get that thing. That guy out of here. Now try to throw a hand axe at me. Get out of here. Just a nibble. No, 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 no. You're not, you're not eating me. No. Wait, wait, I'm not emergency food! <laughs> oh no, we're gonna have to do that as a meme, aren't we? <laughs> yep, new, cha new channel meme, I'm not emergency food. <laughs> I don't even play Genshin and we're gonna have that as a meme. <laughs> oh. Alright, everything's gonna be fine, isn't it? All right, I'm gonna make a rainbow bridge so you can cross. Yes, it's with my lim it's with my power of mana. Yeah, you see, mana is powered by soul juice. And you know what? And you know what soul juice is used for? It's for defeating the great. It's for defeating, you know, uh. It's for defeating genocidal, you know, um, super weapons left by by the gods. Yes. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Go, go, go. Go, go, go! Don't get eaten by a Sharknado! Yes, I unironically like the Sharknado movies. I think they're funny. <laughs> I think they're pretty hilarious, even though, you know, um... Even though, you know, uh, the sixth one was probably the worst one. <laughs> the sixth one was definitely where it was definitely the worst one. It, I thought Global Swarming was pretty good, but, you know... The fourth one definitely kind of, you know, jumped the shark a little bit. Well, just a little bit anyway. Yeah, Sharknado was Sharknado was pretty fun though. Can't tell the people who made it definitely had a lot of fun and you know. And isn't that what matters in the end? Oh no, I'm sleepy! Wake up! Get up, Reese! Get up, Reese! Don't sleep on the job! Now I fell asleep! I'm sleepy! All right, now let's do a power attack. Take that, yeah. Get out of here. Get out of here, you shrimp. Get out of here, shrimp. This is why. That's why winners don't do shrimps. If you do shrimps, you'll go to sleep. And if you go to sleep, you might go to sleep forever. And going to sleep forever is a is a really bad time, guys. <laughs> All right, I might as well save the game. Sure. 
Alright, I'll save the game, I guess. Alright, the game has been saved. Alright, now let's at least do the first boss before we, you know, leave, before we leave. Uh-oh, what's going on here? Alright, the bridge. Is that the whole fairy was talking about? So far. How shall we get over there? Set, let, alright, now form the rainbow bridge. Rainbow Bridge of Salvation activated. Response? I think I will use the residual mana power in the waterfall to get you over there. These sand fairy around here, she's so good and helpful. Let's give it a try. She's what every good fairy in the Sealy Court, you know, aspires to be. But usually isn't. <laughs> At least it's the ideal that we all, that we share. We did it! Alright now. Now, good thing we can just teleport across there. Teleport, I mean, you just made us... Whoops. Well, we need to do the power attack to be able to break the armor. This kind of way I'm doing it on those goblins. Yeah, that's just one little quirk that they seem to have. Alright, now. Uh oh, bats! Too bad there's no giant bat in this game. Shiny bats are the things that make all the rules, guys. Uh, that and if you're the princess of bats, which I clearly am. Uh, the princess of bat that makes. I'm the princess of bats that makes all the rules, guys. Worship me. <laughs> Actually, we're not here to be worshipped. <laughs> Actually, that's not my goal anyway. Yeah, your immediate power attack. Adversaries purified. Yeah, if we do them fast enough. If we do them fast enough without taking much damage, we'll get more XP. We should work together to defeat oh. this threat. After the bad guys. Then with the power attack and then come on them. Whoa, watch out for the watch out for the hand axes. Oh, I'm getting hit by hand axes, that's not good. Alright, alright, get that mushroom in that corner. Alright, we just need to break the armor. Oh, I missed. The mushroom's still alive. Hey, metal, what's up, what's up, what's up? Alright, we have here fight another adversary. Another one bites the dust. Bite the dust, though. Another bad guy bites the dust. Hi, hi there, Metal. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome to the stream. All right, all right, all right. Let's see, there's an item over here. Uh oh. Oh, there's zombies. Zombies? No, not zombies. Get them out of here. Get those zombies out of here. The undead tried to eat. Oh no, I can't. Play. The lore fact. Oh, what kind of lore fact should I go over? Hey, you know, in, you know in the Lord, there's actually a place called the Holiday Lands. Yeah, there's like four major hol. The four ma there's a there's like four major nations there. Of course, there's a whole bunch of minor ones as well. Four major ones are like Christmas, Easter, Valentine's Day, and you know, and let's see, did I say Easter? Easter, Halloween, Christmas, and um, the Saint Valentine's Day. Yeah, all of them have guardian magical girls that guard over them. Yeah. I'm friends with basically all of them, and you know, the one that you know, one that's basically the one that I'm closest with is Hollyanna from you know the Christmas Land. She's a Christmas elf. She used to be, a, she used to be a young girl who you know got you know got reincarnated by you know having her by Santa Claus putting her soul inside of you know a holly tree, and she became a Christmas elf. I thought she has a she has a power of toy magic. Yes. Yeah, she learned how to build. She learned how to make all the cool toys. Yeah, she's a bit. She's a bit like. She's a bit like Toy Man or Toy Maker, and you know, in DC. But you know, a good guy. Yes. <laughs> if that makes any sense to you. All right, now we have some training points we can put in. All right, wait. All right, do we want intelligence? I'll increase the stamina a little bit. 
Twinkle. I definitely want to be able to get Twinkle Rain as I clear Santa Claus taking taking away Truck Hunt's work. And for yeah, no, nope. no Truck. Well, you know, there's actually there actually is Truck Hunt in the in the in the lore. Only Truck Hunt is actually a bad guy in the lore. Yeah, he's actually he's actually a murderous monster truck that you know is possessed by a spirit of a drunk driver. That you know got com that you know got commis that you know got commissioned by an evil god to you know escape people and you know into an escape dream space. Come on, wake up, wake up, wake up! Come on, wake up! Don't fall asleep on the job, Grease. I can't get them up there. I can't get them because they're up there. All right, let's get that gobble out of here. Wait, are you floating in there? All right, wait, what? Another one. Get out of here. Get out of here. Andrew, yeah, Andrew yeah, was basically a mission by an evil god. You know, help. The, you know, help. They don't know, help them. You know, brainwash people and you know, turn them into super soldiers to take care of. You know, you know, you know, take care of them to take care of their rivals. Sounds more like a force of nature than being evil. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. Uh oh, this thing, it looks like a face hugger! Oh no, it's a face hugger! Does this thing not look like a face hugger? Attack like this. No, this isn't the elemental we're looking for. It's a giant monster. So why this thing is basically a face hugger, yeah. Right, watch out watch out for the watch out for the eye beams. There is no time to think. We must act! There's gotta be a weak point somewhere. Oh, watch out for the slam attack. Watch out for the slam attack. Alright, it takes more damage in the face, okay. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Then a big attack there. Alright, get it. Punch it in the face a bunch. Oh, watch out for the eye beams. Oh, Charlotte, no! Oh no, come on, Charlotte. Oh, watch out for the eye beam. Alright, as long as we watch out for the items, it should be fine. Oh wow, you lost an eyeball? Oh, that's surprisingly dark for this game. Yeah, there, Charlotte. That place is toxic. Oh, he, he has like light magic. Uh oh, he's, so, he's aiming the light magic at me. Get off my, get it off me. Come on, punch him in the face. Come on, face hugger, go down. Full oh, metal hugger. It basically, is a face hugger. It's like a giant face hugger, you know, like from aliens or something. Alright, get out of here. Get out of here. By the way, xenomorphs are, are also a thing in the lore. Um, of course, they look more humanoid now. They look more humanoid in the lore, though. But yeah, they're kind of inspired by that as well as they're also mixed with the Earth. They also have brain parasite slugs that are basically their larval form. Oh wow, we, got, we actually level up off that. Excellent. Yeah, though, the Xenomorphs are definitely more humanoid in the lore. Instead of, you know, the traditional alien-looking ones. Of course, we don't call them Xenomorphs because, you know, uh, copyright infringement. Right, good for the good news is we got this. We got the Elemental Spirit of Light. It's a very good thing. Thank you, Anna for being so interested in the lore. Thank you. Where is the light stone? <laughs> it's straight up from here, deep within the And we like the elemental spirit of light, yes. Because it lets you use light magic. Light magic is very good at this point in the game because hey, it gives you the it gives you the heal spells. But you know, heal spells are definitely very valuable for any journey. Huh? I'm just glad we don't have like 10 MP and you know I'm just glad it doesn't cost like 10 NP to use the heal spell. Is this a shortcut? <laughs> I mean, 10 MP. 10. That's as many as, that's as many as two fives. Leave Cascade Cavern, sure. All right, we might as well. Oh, the time of day is changing, uh, shaming the shade time. So it's night time, which means there's gonna be a tougher. Uh, means some of the enemies are going to change. Oh, they're like level 5 now. 
Pretty good level 5 before. These guys don't have armor. You have to break their armor. Tough hand axes. Out here. Okay, there's one that's level 4. I don't believe he's armored though. If the lower level ones are not armored. We must continue to triumph. And Rain's purifying. Emotional damage! What? What do you mean emotional damage? There's no emotional damage. There's no emotional damage. What are you talking about? It is unwise. Okay. Any more enemies on the field now? I'm glad we didn't take any damage. Oh, we get more XP. All right, now I'm glad we have some memes that we can play around with. You're more than welcome to use the same sword for those. All right, this guy has armor. Blades not that tough to pierce. Adversary purified. Yes, we say that every time we purify an enemy because you know you have to make that off reference. <laughs> By the way, I highly recommend you check out Off if you can. Now, Off is a free RPG Maker game, and you know, it's better than a lot of AAA games. I will say that a lot of the puzzles in the game are actually more complex than one, a lot of the ones I'm used to. You know, because modern games, you don't usually have very baby boy easy mode puzzles. Thanks if they have puzzles at all. Saved us some trouble. <laughs> now. Nothing stopping us from invading Wendell. This is a present to show our appreciation. Appreciation for you know break, breaking the barrier so we can invade you, so we can invade Wendell. Let's uh -oh. get going. Hopefully the people of Wendell are able to defend themselves. And we took down their barrier, and we also took down a giant enemy crab, at whose weak point we struck for massive damage, and made their eyeballs fall out. Don't worry, there. Don't worry. Um, Reese is extra plus. Reese had extra plush. You know, uh, extra plush. You know, break. You don't know, break or fall in your chest. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, what's going on now? All right, this must be the opening. Oh, the mana tree continues to wither. A hero must be found to take the sword of mana and awaken our goddess. Then, let us ask the priest of light for guidance. We must not delay any longer. Let's go! Oh, those fairies. Alright, let's watch let's watch these fairies go off and you know their business. I cannot continue. Okay. What do you mean? We're so close! But we can do this! Uh, I can't make it to the other realm. With my powers. Oh no, some of, the, some of these fairies are falling down and you know we don't see them again. I assume they died. Hurry. Oh, we cannot continue either. Please go on without Why looks a little like Aqua? Find our hero and save the mana tree. Hopefully they're okay. And just because we don't see them again doesn't mean they're they're gone, you know. Right now, where are we now? Probably in prison, aren't we? This is probably where we're prisoned. Yep, we're in prison. Oh no, Reese is in jail. That's not good. I don't want those. I don't want those weird beasts been doing weird things what to her. No. Hey, finally, they, I can see their parachutes. Excuse me. Release me immediately. I don't think those guys are willing to listen. Will you keep quiet? <sighs> hey, hey, here, here's Angela. I am sorry. Do you know? 
Angela. The best character in the game. This place is the Jad's. That's what the most uh, beautiful, nice yes. One. Nice to meet you. Looks like you got caught by the beast men too. Doesn't she look a little like that sorceress you know that was in East Memories of Salsada? I for one am not going to I'm sure they're unrelated though. I have an idea. I mean her mom more acts like that, really. I'll get us all out. <laughs> Quit your yakking. Keep quiet. Extra flush. <laughs> Yeah, that extra flesh, and you know her chest region. I can't get these laces on. I need to change my clothes. Oh. Uh. Please come a little closer. Wait, are you flirting with the guard? Yes, ma'am. Uh oh. Get whacked with stick. Yeah, the guards for some reason did disarm everybody of their weapons. Big mistake. You tricked me. Of course you got tricked, dummy. Please. Not my fault you fell for that. Loser. <laughs> In your lower back as well. Sorry to keep you waiting. Yeah. Shall we go? In, you know, in the butt region. Go. Just don't get Yeah, that extra plush in the butt region. We can take the boat docked at the port and get out of here. The Beastmen forces are distracted now that they're attacking Wendell. We can catch that boat before it sets sail. The townsfolk were talking about it. Okay, then. Before we leave, you should really stop at that mana statue and heal your wounds. We don't have all day. Angela is joining the party. Yes, of course, I do want to go over and go. Yeah, how do you like being tricked? Curses, you got me! <laughs> That's what you sure did. Alright, now let's save the game. Where about Angie has been waifus? Has been waifus? Has been waifus since I played the original Tarios of Mana? Oh. I agree, she's a very good waifu. Alright, let's go look for somebody to raid right now. Alright, there's gotta be somebody good on. Let's see, I know exactly who we can raid. I know who we can raid. Raid. Yo, Una. Score. Alright, now. Remember to play games and have fun, okay? And thank you very much for watching. This was a good this was a good idea. Now let's go. Remember today's raid message is Moonbat Raid. Moonbat's raid.